some exciting things education wise happening at TJC because you guys just had unveiled a new bachelor's program. So talk a little bit about what the program actually is. Well, we're really excited. Uh, TJC is a level two institution, so we have the caliber to be able to offer baccalaureate programs just mm -hmm. like a four-year institution. So our caliber of our professors and our services are just like a four-year institution. So we are proud that our program is going to be uh, instituting the second bachelor's program at Tyler Junior College on January 17th. Um, it is a bachelor's of applied technology in medical technology and healthcare systems, and we're very excited. It's going to be a accelerated rated program which okay. means it's going to be one class at a time in a five week kind of a hybrid style mm -hmm. and we are very happy because we are able to offer that to the healthcare community. And, and it gets the, the students up to speed on everything new that is uh, affecting that, uh, I guess, that, that degree and that, that workforce to get them out uh, and, and contributing to society in it such a way. It certainly does. I'll let Loretta kind of expand right. on well, that. Well, you know, I, I think that we could both say both of us have been in healthcare for a long time, but what we've seen, and we have exceptional, exceptional employees there they have never gotten their higher education but they want to go back and healthcare is very complex and it's right. changing and so this degree focuses on those trends that information to lead them into really into the future to expand their skills to expand their knowledge and then give them practical information that they can use when they go right to work. So it's a win for that that student. It's also a win for those employers. Absolutely. And East Texas is, I mean, it's it's kind of the a medical central hub, yes. especially in Tyler and over in yes. Longview. How could this right here play an impact in the growth of the medical community just here uh, you know, locally? Well, if you think about it, when we started assessing whether or not there is a need for this, we pulled in representatives from all around the healthcare community here in this area, and they all said, yes, definitely there's a need because there was not a bachelor's program that went from associate's degrees to the master. So there was a really a hole here mm -hmm. in Tyler. And so they all definitely needed that. These students need this for promotion, for career advancement. And if you think about baby boomers who are na now maybe leading in that higher level administration that are retiring, the other ones are moving in. Now we have a gap here for these to be prepared and ready to go and take on that next leadership. Ready to role. make sure everything's very Absolutely. streamlined and uh, yes. seamless and, and smooth. That's right. And if people want to apply for the program, how can they do that or so what are some of the steps that they need to take? Well, sure. we have a wonderful website on the TJC. Uh, if you go to tjc.edu slash HTMS, um, there's an information packet that gives a lot of information about the types of classes that we're offering. Okay. Um, we're offering things about compliance and risk management and statistics and healthcare finance and employment law. I mean, really things specific Everything to the healthcare that field. Need that they would need. So if you go on to the tjc.edu slash htms, it'll mm -hmm. give you the information. And we also have four information sessions that are going to be coming up. Okay. And those dates and times are on there. So if you just want to get some general information, ask some questions, sign Do up that. for one of those information sessions, and you'll get everything that you possibly well, need. Well, thank you both so much for Thank you very much. I really much appreciate for it. And we'll be right back with a final.